In this video, I'm going to show you how to remove known host keys in your Mac OS terminal. See, if you're trying to access to your server and you have changed your root details or something like that, then your host key, which is actually attached to your IP address, which you may be using to log in through mac os terminal so how to correct that see if you have a error something like that that it is possible that somebody is doing something nasty or something like that and you know you have changed your operating system or something like that and you want to change your host key then you are in the right video so what you need to do is just type out these particular command here so first ssh as you can see here there's the host key which is already presented here user slash my name and slash dot ssh and known host the thing is i've been trying to access to my root server but the host key for that particular root server as you can see the ip of that root server is already there so to connect to our my new details of my server i need to delete the old host keys okay so how you can do that you can do that easily with this command ssh dot keygen oh, sorry hyphen keygen and then r and now in this section either you can just enter your server name like you have a server name of baby.com something like that or you can just enter your ip address here i want will be enter my ip address here see if it does revert anything so it says these are the host keys which is already presented there okay so all the host keys which is are already updated with the new ones okay so whenever you try to log in with the new details you will be logging with easily with this command so if you have something like that uh, like a host name like a webby.com or something like that you can easily do it with the sss keygen slash r or hyphen r or however you want to pronounce and you just need to enter your server name there okay so let's see if i'm able to log into my server so yes so as you can see it is actually giving me an authorization and asking me to confirm if they want to or if I want to register a new host name so I will just type it the yes here so it will ask for the password so for the password I just need to copy and paste here so if you have learned something from this click the like button and if you want more videos like this and if you want to learn more and more about the server administration so see you in the next video until then bye bye